At 430, the National Weather Service says Hawaii will likely see more rainfall than average during the wet season, which runs from December to April. Chief Meteorologist Jennifer Robbins explains how that will affect the state's significant drought conditions in our first alert outlook. A developing La Nina has led to a fairly quiet hurricane season so far for Hawaii. But that is a much different story in the Atlantic Basin, with two major hurricanes making landfall and devastating parts of the southeast. La Nina is favored uh, to emerge in the tropical Pacific by the uh, end of November and then is expected to persist until spring of next year. La Nina brings cooler than average ocean temperatures by the equatorial Pacific. And as we look ahead into the winter months, how will this global climate pattern impact the islands? If the wet season really kicks in in earnest, then you know things should improve. This will be good news for the drought conditions we've been facing across the state. Fortunately, Hawaii Island did see record rain with Hone that came through. But for the rest of us, as we head into the winter months, we could really use the precipitation. We've been seeing abnormally dry conditions and even on Kauai, extreme. That by the end of April, I'm, I think that map will be completely empty, you know, in terms of the for the drought monitor map. And currently, the dry brush has led to several red flag warnings this year, with the most recent earlier this week, as we face gusts up to 48 miles per hour. The key to less fire weather concerns will be moist air and more rain, hopefully this winter. The enhanced rainfall and you know, re, um, the reduction of uh, dry forage, that greatly re reduces the uh, chance of uh, wildfires during this time of year. While we can't predict just how intense upcoming first alert rain events will be in months ahead, the climate outlook calls for a higher chance overall. With this outlook, Kodama reminds our island community to always have a safety plan in place. If the wet season and flooding uh, takes place, have a plan, prepare in advance, um, and know, know your routes if you're in flood prone areas. And don't drive across flooded streams or hike across, uh, hike across uh, swollen streams. And make sure to download the HNN First Alert weather app for the latest forecasts and tracking rain this winter using our interactive radar. First Alert Chief Meteorologist Jennifer Robbins, Hawaii News Now.